It's one of China's 15 nuclear power plants. The Taishan plant is home to two nuclear reactors. And according to CNN, the U.S. government has spent the past week assessing a report of a leak at the plant. The American news network reported that French energy giant EDF, which co-owns the plant, had warned of a, quote, imminent radiological threat. According to the company, the buildup of krypton and xenon is a known phenomenon. Local managers even elected to allow the plant to continue to operate. But this expert says the leak should have led to the shutdown of all operations. Rather than obey existing limits which would have forced workers to shut the reactor down, officials chose to simply raise those limits to avoid shutting down the plant. Chinese authorities say there has been no contamination of the surrounding environment. This EPR plant, which uses a new pressurized water design, was inaugurated in 2018. The same technology is currently being implemented in several projects across Europe, but they've been subject to years of delays. The Flamanville plant in northern France was supposed to open in 2012. It won't be operational until 2023, and its total cost has been multiplied by three.